Hello, I'm Wayne Barsby, head teacher at the Holgate School, and welcome to this my latest video blog. I want to talk today about uh, the next generation of students at the Holgate School and look ahead a little bit to the next school year. Last Thursday, uh, we had the privilege of welcoming our new Year 7 students, current Year 6s at the primary schools, for an induction day, and they gave a fantastic first impression of themselves. Uh, many staff were impressed by their good manners, by their positive manner around the school and we want to build upon that. They had three fantastic lessons in school where they are able to get a flavour of what it's like to be a secondary student. They had time with their new house groups and they spent time with older students there who were guiding them, showing them around and we hope being a positive influence on them going forward in school. The evening was very successful too. We had time with parents in school and able to set out for them what we want to achieve with their sons and daughters as they join us and hopefully looking forward we'll be able to work in strong partnership to do that. That's the next generation of youngsters at our school and we're looking forward very much to welcoming them in September. Looking forward as well we've got a new school improvement plan to drive forward change in school for the next year and we've got three principal priorities that we're going to work on there. First of all, improving student progress and attainment. That's about making sure every youngster moves forward in his or her learning so that by the end of each year when you get progress reports you can see that their attainment, their achievement in subjects has moved on. So we're going to really work hard on that, building independent learners, youngsters doing well and high quality teaching to support that. We're also looking to improve student engagement and the inclusion of all youngsters in the life of the school. That's both within lessons more and more variety of teaching uh, strategies to get them engaged in the learning as well as beyond lessons. More opportunities out of school hours, after school clubs in technology, in science, in ICT, in PE for instance, lots of teams that represent the school and trips and visits and by getting youngsters signed up for things in school beyond the school day we think it gives them greater ownership of the whole school, a bigger involvement in the community and we hope that will pay a dividend when they come to achieve their best in school. And finally, we're really trying to develop uh, improved leadership of teaching and learning. Of course, that starts with me as head teacher and all leaders through the school and all teachers in the school. And we're trying to drive forward our understanding of where youngsters do well, the reasons for them doing well, and to repeat that across more subject areas. That's a challenging thing to do, but we're prepared to tackle that challenge in the year ahead to try and enhance students' results and to ensure that all our youngsters fulfil their potential. So there's some of the things come up ahead. As we reach the end of the summer term, next Thursday, the 21st of July, is the last day of term. So just advance notice for parents and carers. We'll finish that day at 12.30 and youngsters will then be allowed to make their way home on that day. Uh, we're as yet uncertain that we'll be able to provide the best with bus. We're in negotiations with the company, but we will confirm with students whether that is running or not. If it isn't, we'll ask them to make alternative arrangements with you. Thanks very much for watching today though and I hope for parents of Year 6s we will attach some pictures to the end of this and you can have a look at their experience of their day, first day ever at Holgate School.